Yo, what's happening people and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be making a beat using only sounds and libraries from the team at Pattern Sounds. If you're new to the channel, then do me a favour and make sure that subscribe button's grey and click the bell next to it too if you'd like to be notified every time that I upload. Now with all that said, let's jump straight into it. So to start off with, I just want to lay down some chords and for that I'm going to be using the hotel piano. All of the libraries and other sounds that I use will be available to download in the video description too. So yeah, I've got my hotel piano loaded up. I'm working at 140 BPM and I'm going to start this beat off in D minor. So now I'm just going to go ahead and lay down some chords. For the first counter melody, I'm going to be using vintage strings and I'm pretty much just going to use the ghost notes for my chords to help me come up with a melody. The next instrument I'm going to be adding is the newest addition to our library and it's called the Kalimba Plus. And as you probably guessed, this library was made by sampling the Kalimba and then processing the sounds to make five distinctive presets. Once the instrument has been loaded into either contact or the decent sampler, you can then pick from the following presets. The dry preset is a blank canvas which you can then process yourself using your own effects to get whatever sound you want to go for. The dark preset is perfect for making trap, drill and any other dark genres of music. The lo-fi preset has a nice tape effect and as you probably guessed that's going to be perfect for making lo-fi beats. The pluck preset has a nice spacey reverberated sound which is going to sound really nice in future bass and other EDM genres. And lastly we have the funk preset that comes complete with an 808 cowbell making this the go-to preset for funk beats. These different presets are accessible from the key switch section of contact or you can also use the notes on your MIDI keyboard. We also decided to release a MIDI expansion with the Kalimba Plus so you guys can download both of them and instantly start making fire beats. The Kalimba and the expansion can both be bought separately however if you buy them together you'll also receive a 20% discount. 
If you want to check out the library or the expansion pass, then use the link in my description, which will take you over to my website. I'm going to be using the dark preset and all I want to do here is make a third melody that I can bring in during the hook and the bridge as well. I want this melody to have a bit of a faster pace and once again, I'm going to be using the ghost notes on my piano roll to help me figure out where I want the notes to go. So I like the way that sounds, now I'm just going to split this by track and then start arranging it.
that's going to bring us to the end of today's video. Let me know how you think the beat turned out in the comments. Again, if you'd like to check out any of the sounds that are used in this beat, then I'm going to be leaving links to all the libraries as well as the drum kit in the video's description. If you enjoyed this video, if you learned anything new from it, then make sure to hit that thumbs up before you leave. And if you're new to the channel, then do me a favor and turn that subscribe button gray. Massive shout out to anybody that made it all the way to the end of the video. Thanks again for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.